Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today we'll be reviewing tips for replacing the crankshaft position sensor on this 2014 Chevy Cruze. Now let's get started. Some of the symptoms that might indicate that you have a faulty crankshaft position sensor would be a no start, a very hard start, and engine code P0335. The sensor is mounted on the engine block between the starter and the engine. I will attempt to demonstrate the location for you. So standing on the driver's side of the vehicle, I'm zooming in and you could see that this wire right here is, is connected to the sensor and it goes down into that area behind the starter. The starter is located right there. You can see the starter. This, this bolt is not a part of the starter. The starter is there. Now I'm touching the starter, which is about maybe five inches below this bolt that's showing right there. I'm going to try to zoom in for you. There's the starter right there. Okay. I've been underneath the vehicle and I've been on top of the vehicle. You have to remove the starter. You cannot remove the sensor without removing the starter. So that does make this job a little bit challenging. And you can remove the starter. It's very simple. Um, there's two bolts holding on the starter. One thing you want to be careful of is you always disconnect the battery before you uh, attempt to remove the starter. Once you have the starter off, you can go ahead and remove the sensor. There's a rubber housing covering the, the engine block. The wire goes down through that housing. Just pull the rubber, go down in there, unscrew the sensor, replace the sensor, mount the rubber housing back on, mount the starter back on, and you're ready to go. I hope you guys found my tips to be helpful. I wish I could, could have been more helpful for this particular video. Please like and subscribe, and until next time, drive defensively.